Tiger tragedy strikes British Zoo. A tiger killed a zookeeper in the UK on Monday in an incident the zoo described as a freak accident. Zookeeper Rosa King was mauled to death by one of the Hammerton Zoo Park's four tigers when the big cat somehow got into a part of their enclosure where she was working. Witnesses said zoo staff tried to distract the beast by throwing meat into the enclosure and shouting, but it didn't work. Families visiting the zoo said they feared there was a tiger on the loose and so they ran for their lives. The zoo said the tiger did not escape from the tiger enclosure at any time. The zoo said King's death was a freak accident and that it was investigating how the tiger managed to get into the same part of the enclosure as her at the same time. Rosa King was 33 years old. Relatives of the zookeeper said she loved tigers and her death was a tragedy. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Tigers are beautiful, but we should never forget they are wild animals that act on instinct. Tiger mauls woman to death at Beijing Safari Park. One woman was killed and another woman was injured when the pair was mauled by tigers after they left their car at a wildlife park in Beijing. According to Chinese media, the woman got into a fight with a man in the car and got out of the vehicle. CCTV footage shows the woman standing beside the car before being attacked and dragged away by a tiger. The man then runs out of the car and tries to help. It's unclear if he was injured. A second older woman was mauled and killed by another tiger after she jumped out and attempted to help. Ba Daling Wildlife World in Beijing is known for rearing large groups of dangerous animals that roam wide open areas which visitors can drive through in their own cars. Visitors are told to keep their doors locked and windows fully closed while in the park. Park officials quickly arrived at the scene but were unable to save one of the women. Authorities said the woman who survived was receiving medical treatment. Tiger mauled zookeeper after she walks into enclosure. 38-year-old zookeeper Stacy Conweiser, who was known fondly as the Tiger Whisperer among staff at the Palm Beach Zoo, may have overestimated her ability to handle the tigers at the Florida exhibit she oversees. On April 22nd, shortly before 2 p.m., Conweiser was checking on a male Malayan tiger before putting on a routine show for the public called Tiger Talk. Zoo officials said Conweiser entered a night house designated for the tigers to eat and sleep, which was clearly marked as accessible to the tigers. Once in, Conweiser was attacked by one of the male Malayan tigers. A code red was immediately initiated by the zoo staff and the tiger was shot with a tranquilizer. Her colleagues were unable to aid her until the big cat fell asleep. When he finally did, they had her airlifted to a nearby area hospital, where she was pronounced dead. The zoo officials do not yet know why Stacy Conweiser went into the tiger enclosure, but said five separate investigations are underway to figure out what happened. Conweiser had worked with the endangered Malayan tigers for three years until her death. Her husband, Jeremy, is also a staff member at the Palm Beach Zoo. A Siberian tiger killed a zookeeper in Germany as patrons nearby watched the incident unfold. It was public feeding time for the Siberian tigers and patrons had gathered to watch. 56-year-old zookeeper Martin H. went in but one of the tigers, Rasputin, leapt up and fatally bit him in the neck where he had his back to the dangerous animal. Watching in horror, patrons were forced to leave the zoo as police arrived at the scene. The zoo's director told reporters that the keeper had worked there for 20 years and that he, quote, loved his animals. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. A 21-year-old woman is in a critical condition after being mauled by a tiger at a feline sanctuary near Indianapolis. Marisa Dubb was cleaning an enclosure around 1 p.m. when an 18-year-old tiger named Raja got back in from a holding area through an improperly secured gate and attacked Marissa. When co-workers arrived, the tiger had Dub's head in its mouth. They were able to rescue Dub by spraying water in the tiger's face and tossing it some meat. Within six minutes, workers were able to move the tiger back into a contained area. Dub was then airlifted to Wishard Memorial Hospital.